Hey guys, welcome to another uh, video from 545 Vlogs. So now I am in Tata showroom in Whitela. So what we have here is the 2020 Tata Nexon XZ Plus variant. The 2020 Tata Nexon has undergone BS6 norms and is here with the uh, facelift. I feel it's a lot more appealing now. It kind of reminds me of the Range Rover Evoque a bit. Let me know what you feel in the comment section. So back to the video, you can see that the grills have changed. Now it uh, gets a sleek piano black finish, which makes it look premium. You can also see a chrome plate uh, coming below that. The bonnet I feel is a bit raised, uh, kind of uh, gives a muscular look. The headlights have also changed to meet with the new design. All the variants except the base get the projector headlamps. Coming to the tires, the profile is 215-60R16. The alloys have changed as well. Now it gets new diamond shaped design which is even more attractive. Mirrors now get glossy black finish. You can see white insert in contrast with the black pillars to match the design. On the top you can see roof railings uh, to give a SUV kind of an appeal. It also get a shark fin antenna design uh, which I think is cool. From the sides it's very similar to the previous generation uh, Nexons. Moving to the rear now there are some minor changes. Now Nexon badging is in the center and uh, it's bigger. Also from now onwards Tata would not mention the variant of the cars using the badging. The bumpers have also changed. You can see some scuff plates in the bottom and uh, it also get reflectors on either sides they have also placed a tata logo in a very appealing position you can also see some white insert in the rear as well the tail light it is clear lens and also get an led so with some very minor changes they have managed to give it a fresh look the boot space is about 340 liters uh, large enough to store a uh, three four trolley bags the boot light is uh, included in the left hand side. Since Nexon is aiming families, uh, this is very convenient. By the way, this is a new color code, foliage green, that comes with the 2020 Nexon. You can see body color door handles. Apart from the matte black pillars, it looks very similar to the previous generation Nexon. Overall, the 2020 Nexon looks sharper thanks to the clamshell bonnet headlamps and a slimmer grille. You can see the new digital uh, instrument cluster. Overall the quality has improved, there are a few changes in the designs. On the doors you can see the regular uh, window controls. They have given a controller to adjust the ORVMs. The steering is new. Uh, this was first found in Tiago. Few controls have been included on the steering. Uh, it also get a piano black finish. The infotainment system get IRA connectivity which was developed by Tata themselves. Coming to inside, uh, they have added some graphic elements to make the interiors interesting. Piano black finish is added to the center console to make it even more appealing. You get three drive modes that actually work. You get city, eco and sport. You can feel the difference clearly while driving. Up in the dashboard, you have the AC vents and uh, the infotainment controls. AC controls are given just below that. You get decent thigh and uh, side support. Also very comfortable uh, leg space. I had pulled back the uh, driver seat to the maximum um, but still there is enough space for my legs it is designed in a way that you get decent headroom as well the seatings also get designed similar to the graphics uh, you can see the same design uh, in the below just below the front grille as well i guess they are using it like a theme for the car you also get ac vents in the rear as well uh, it's a bit dark i hope you can see it clearly The rear windows are also of good size. It kind of gives you an airy feel. 
just behind the rear seat they have included a charging port which is very practical 